Hello everybody, Wingcap here, and welcome back to I Am Bread. So, now, uh, let's uh, carry on with this level that, by the way, I have never beaten before, ever. This is pretty much... Ah, eh! uh, oh jeez, ah oh jeez, I'm already messing up. I'm messing up, no, 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 why? Uh, 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 this is why I've never beaten it before, because it's hard! It's freaking hard! But that's okay. Because if I can beat this during this Let's Play, it will officially be my first time ever fully completing the story mode of I Am Bread for all of you to see. Which is great! because then we can share that moment together. As some of you may have noticed, I also, uh, updated- Ah! Oh! Oh, gosh! No, no, no! No! No, 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 no! Okay. Okay, we made it. We made it! Come on! Up! Dun! Dun! Come on! Uh. Whoop! Uh, there we are. Okay, so, as I was saying, some of you may have noticed that I put up a new banner, uh, for my channel. Oh, here. Hopefully, that'll make the channel look a bit better. There, so, uh, I can get more viewers. Uh, oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. This, this level it has really tricky footing on it. Lots of spindly places that ain't easy for a piece of bread to grab onto. Uh, I pretty much have a good idea of how I'm supposed to beat this. Yes, I'm just... You know, it's just the execution, man. Uh. Alright. So, yeah. Uh, I think, like, originally, those, like, bags of... Uh, those bags of, like, fertilizer down there, or whatever they are, they were, they were blatant, like, yeah, they're fertilizer. Uh, they were more blatantly, like, uh, bags of, uh, charcoals, you know, for grills. So, yeah, pretty much, it's kind of ridiculous how everything about this gas station just speaks flammable. There's gas tanks, there's firewood... Anti-freeze, WD-40, heat lighters, and at one point there was charcoals, now it's just simply fertilizer. Which is, actually, thing about it, still flammable. Okay. Okay. Easy. Easy. Okay. Whew. Yeah. They take off the brand, but that is definitely what that is, WD-40. Just from the coloring and the type of can. <laughs> One thing I... WD-40, nowadays, whenever I see it, it uh, anywhere, I'll just be, like, thinking of King of the Hill for some reason. Be like, WD-40! Or, WD-40! Okay. I, I don't know how good that impression was. Probably was not that good. Okay. Okay. Come on! Ah! No! No! Pick yourself up, Fred. Gotta let go of that for a bit. Come on! Oh, wait. Okay, maybe that's how you do it. Maybe that's how it's done. Like, I saw a note. I saw, a, like, uh, I'm not gonna name names, but I saw, like, a video of some sort of someone beating this level, and they sort of just, like, use their bread to will the new 
Rice paper around like a flying saucer. So, I'm hoping maybe I can use this newspaper as a way to glide across. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, no. Get flat. Come on. Lay it flat. There we are! Okay. Restore our grip. And once again, slide it. Slide it. I'm slowly making my way towards victory. With this lighter. Yes! Yes. Okay, yes. Ugh. <sighs> In the meantime, I can talk about some other things while we wait for me to slowly make my way across this floor. Just, uh, yeah, the grip's gonna run out there. Okay, let's let it build back up here. And once again! Up! Oh. So, yeah. Um, I recently, he, like, I've recently got, like, a strong desire for some reason to play a good dating sim. But my problem is, like, so many of them um, just lead to... Uh, like, the problem is that so many of them lead to stuff like porn and whatnot. And I'm just like... Like, I, dude, I don't want that. I just want to go out with a girl. I just... I don't want to have sex with her on the first freaking date. Oh gosh, no! 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 Oh dang it. I didn't know it could blow me away. Oh well, that just means the episode's gonna be longer. Anyways. But, uh, yeah. I don't know if you know this about me, but I'm not the type that even that knows what to do. It's like, I guess it was raised more to not really be into that kind of stuff. Uh, call me weird here to here to some, but like I just don't have a strong interest in overly sexual things. Things so yeah. Pretty much I was like, no, I want a nudity free sex sexual in overtones free kind of dating sim one that's more about the relationship unfortunately the only one that i'd heard of that was actually good but to some degree was uh, freaking uh, in a toeful boyfriend and i'm sure and i'm sure that's a nice game and all it's just yeah i'm kind of i'm kind of weird about the prospect of not only dating guys in that, as playing a game, I'm not only weirded out by the prospect of playing a dating sim where you're a girl trying to get guys, but one where you're a human trying to get, uh, trying to hook up with birds. I'm like, like, what? I don't know, I'm just not into that. I have a friend uh, who was like so, but I'm not gonna name any names. But suffice it to say, I have a, I have a friend uh, who was like really into Hey Toeful boyfriend, and was like, and they were just like, like always suggesting me to play it, and I'm like, no, I don't wanna. I look at their Steam page once, and set, uh, and guess what? Game has all of the achievements unlocked. Yeah, that's right. A doleful boyfriend. The dating sim where you're a human girl trying to get with birds. Uh, but yeah. But yeah, I be. Uh, but anyways, I ended up finding out this one uh, free-to-play Steam game that seemed to be all right, at least somewhat. Okay, uh, whoop. Okay, well. I could have gone better, but, uh... No, no, don't go near the floor. Don't go away from the lighter. Bread! Gah! Eh. 
Get off of me! Yeah! <laughs> Buddy! Yeah. I feel like that one guy from the Will Ferrell movie, Elf. That's actually a surprisingly good Christmas film. Some people might not think of it too highly because it stars Will Ferrell and it's like, you know, obviously poking fun at like old Christmas specials, but still, it, it, I think it's, I think, oh, no, okay, I think it's a good movie, but yeah. Anyways, getting back to my old subject, uh, I basically f ended up finding this freeware game called Emily. He is away or something. And, uh, it's kind of weird because it's a dating sim where, like, like, the whole thing is told in, like, messages between two friends on, like, one of those old style chat rooms. Rooms. It's, like, set between. It's, like,. Like, basically, to give you a picture of, like, what what time it takes place in, the game starts, uh, starts and it's, like, 2002, and each uh, chapter is basically a year that has gone by in the protagonist's life. How do I grab my lighter? No, 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 no! That's the wrong way to grab it. Okay. Ah. Wait. No! No! Stop rodeoing! I lost. Again. But yeah, pretty much there are six chapters and it is free to play. Hey, hey, I don't know what... I don't know if the creators of the game are going to be alright with me, like, plugging their product here, but, like... I can't... Pretty much, it's a dating sim, but it's like... Slash... I guess you could call it a dating sim slash visual novel. Oh, about two friends communicating through instant messaging and whatnot. Alright. And I'm like, well, it's free to play, okay, so I can at least give it... So I should at least give it a try. Because, you know... Because in my opinion, you know, if you're not sure... If I'm not sure how a game is, just from the reviews it gets on Steam, I'll usually be like, okay, if it's free to play, I can't, and at least play it for myself. I don't like to really chance myself on games I don't know about. And, you know, and sometimes the reviews on Steam can and be sort of eclectic. Like, some people will say it's good, others say it's really bad and broken. And I'm like, I don't know who to believe! So, yeah. It pretty much... It was pretty weird. Really, like there's no bit. Like I actually expected there to be like a twist. Like, like this girl's online friend, and isn't who they tur turn out to be. But no, it actually ended up a kind of charming, charming story about how two young lovers. Well, lovers. Okay, not lovers, because they're not. Because there's no sex at any point from what I saw. But yeah. I ended up get. Anyways, my end. Anyways, I guess it has multiple endings. I just know that the ending I got uh, had pretty much both of them. Had pretty much the both of them. Uh, um, not knowing uh, where to go in their friendship. 
mishap and the main protagonist is all just like, No! How do I say that I love you? Or something like that. Woo! Haha! <laughs> Alright, so. Yeah. Bring paper hers into that originally just made, made the whole thing kind of weird. So here we are again. Trying. That's the wrong button. Okay. Wait. Maybe I should check to make sure. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not holding on to the lighter. But yeah, that game, it was like super short and weird, kind of. But, you know, for a free-to-play game, it's alright. What kind of threw me off was, it's like, it gives you multiple responses, and then proceeds to, like, I like go, begin typing using the keyboard, and I'm like, oh, do I just write my interpretation on that? That, uh, or something? And then, and then I realized, oh, wait, no. The game, because what that uh, game actually does is, uh, is uh, you choose a preset option for text, and then you just sort of press random keys on your keyboard to make the text come up. Up, like it's simulating, like it's simulating what would actually be going on, like actual typing. I'm like, oh, that's interesting. But yeah. Again, I... I kinda wanna get into, like... I, I kinda wanna... Like, I don't really have that much uh, experience with relationships. So I thought... So I've been thinking, you know, maybe I... That one kind of fun thing would to do would be maybe to practice social skills on a dating sim. But again, the problem is, there's a lot of dating sims that will just be like... 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 Oh, now you're suddenly having sex and stuff. I'm like, no! I didn't come for sex, I came for a deep, meaningful relationship. And don't you dare, dare drop that lighter, you silly, silly piece of silly, silly bread. Okay, grab onto the valve. Grab, grab it, come on. I'll see that. Now I've gone done it, you've dropped the lighter. Okay. Oop. Dang it. Okay. Trying to figure this out. Yes. Had better not crash on me, gosh darn it. Okay, there we go, it was just loading. Woohoo! Oh, and look at that, I got an A++. I think that's the first time I've ever gotten that kind of score. So, we unlocked an epilogue? 
To whom it may concern, it was the bread. It's always been the bread. It needs to become toast, and it will stop at nothing. My house was the start, but it won't be the end. I was forced to escape the fair the therapy barn. Ern. I should have destroyed the bread while I had the chance. Now there's been explosion across town, and I know it's the bread. I'm going to find that cursed loaf and end this once and for all. Mr. Bieber Bis Mr. M B. Merton. Bill Merton? Uh, what is this? Uh, oh, okay, I see. We're in the trunk. And we need to escape. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, okay, I see. It's open. Come on! You can do it, Bread! We all believe in you! I can't do it. <laughs> Come on. Yes. 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 Uh, yes. Yes! We escaped! That... Uh. Wait, that wasn't it? Well then, if we're not supposed to escape, what the heck are we supposed to- Maybe we're supposed to get to the front of the car or something. Like, toast ourselves on the hood and while he's driving. Something. It Come toast even in this. Uh, this is so weird. I can do this. I'll just have to make the episode longer, won't I? It's kind of hard to see it, though, because it's so dark. Okay. Now we're... Lost my grip. Maybe the side, maybe? Okay. I guess we don't lose that ability here if we mess up. So that's at least comforting. Gotta hold on! For dear life! Life of bread! It's like a life of pie! But way less. That's visually impressive. Okay, I made it. Sort of. Okay, we're on the bumper. Oh, okay, I get it. This is the part where I'm supposed to use my parkour skills. Climb up the car without f falling. Okay. Oh, dang it! Now we're back to square one again. This ain't easy, you know, Mr. Merton. Bim Merton. Like Tim Burton. Escaped again. Is this seriously it? Is this seriously it? Is this all I'm supposed to do is just sort of constantly try to plot myself out? I don't get it. Um. 
I don't know. I don't know, guys. Maybe if I... Careful. 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 Ooh. Okay, now we're on. All right, cool. We're on uh, equal footing, at least. I guess I don't know. Oh gosh. Okay. Okay, I think. I think I'm just supposed to climb up. Easy, easy. Careful. Uh. It's like a horror movie where we're the monster coming back for our revenge. Whoop! Except we gotta fight with this now. Feels just like Shao of the Colossus. Climbing up something, trying to shake us off, but we won't. We won't be so easily bested. Will we, viewers? Can't. Oh, okay. I see it now. We're just supposed to flop constantly. Instead of letting the wind constantly wrestle with us. Ah! My, this is my last journey. I can make it. Okay, now I'm in the car. Am I supposed to get his attention now? Make him crash? That would be... That would make us a naughty brat, wouldn't it? We are a very naughty slice of Hey, yo, dude! You got a light that I can heat myself on? I'm getting clearly inedible, but what do I care? It's the last episode. Come on! Come on! Maybe. Mr. Merton. <laughs> Cue the dun 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 music. Oh, his name is Bob. Bob Merton. Oh, 
Oh my gosh! I have never seen this before. I Am Bread is a prequel to Surgeon Simulator! It all makes sense now. The bread, the heart, the lungs, the, the, the blood, the so much blood! It's all coming together. Illumini confirmed, guys. Just Illumini confirmed. Alert everyone! Everyone! <sighs> well, thank you all for watching this lovely series. Um, probably gonna do something else uh, in the near future in addition to Fallout 3. Uh, Fallout 3 will probably still be going on and in the meantime. But, uh, yeah. Until then, guys, until then, and please, please leave your feedback and comments in the comments section below. Uh, also, and, uh, suggest ways I can improve myself. I really do want to still get better, er, especially since I've only completed two games so far on this channel. So, uh... Also, check out my other videos, and even, you know, oh, follow me on Twitter, Tumblr, or stuff like that. And, and, until next time, until next game, stay cappy, my friends. Stay cappy.